So for my overall thoughts, now I'm on record in my uh, Alphabet Squadron review saying that it was boring and dull, it did not get a very good grade. Uh, I read book two, absolutely loved it, gave it I think an A+. This book, I loved it as well. I, I really liked this book, it was mostly everything that I was hoping it would be. The last time we saw these characters, they were all put in really tough and surprising situations. That element continues on through this story as many of the cast goes through extreme changes and adjustments. Now, By the time this story concludes, I found that some of the character arcs were very satisfying, while some were left open or just a little too awkward. Alexander Freed's writing style is outstanding. The novel feels more than just sci-fi fantasy, it feels real. From the dialogue to the descriptions, every moment was fleshed out so nicely. The way Freed creates characters and what he puts them through is just incredible and satisfying. The war has changed these people. There's no easy walk in the park for anyone. The heroes suffer. The desperation for victory or death just drives the plot. The book read quickly. Not one time did I feel like I was wasting my precious time or did I drift off into boredom. My eyes were glued to the pages all the way to the end. I had a blast reading this book. I did not want to put it down. Every time I picked it up, I just absorbed it. I was just going through it so fast. I loved it. There's one negative thing that I have to say about this book, and it's uh, this little moment at the end of the story that feels like that check the box, gotta include that one thing in the story, only because it comes across so unnatural and very much like an afterthought. However, overall, Victory's Price is a fast-paced, nail-biting conclusion to the Alphabet Squadron trilogy. Freed's brilliance and storytelling ability is just next level. So for the rating, I will give Victory's Price an A. And that'll do it for this book review. Remember to find me across all social media at The Geeks Attic. Hit that subscribe button and that thumbs up. Have a good one.